In this video, we are going to walk you through the registration process. You will need to go to UTEP's main page, which is myutep.edu. Once you're there, click at Goldmine located at the left side bars. It will then ask you to log into your UTEP account. Thereafter you log on, you will need to know which classes to add before you register. In this case, we will show you how to run your degree plan. Go to Student Records, click on Degree Evaluation, select the term, and press Submit. As you can see, it will display your curriculum information. Select Generate New Evaluation. Click on your curriculum information. Once again, select the term and generate the request. In here, you will see the requirements you need to fulfill to be able to graduate. It will show you your program description, program evaluation, your degree areas, and university core curriculum area. On math section, yes would mean you have already completed all the classes for the requirement. No, meaning would be you have not completed the classes or classes to meet the requirement. Keep in mind, classes that start with one are for freshmen, two for sophomores, and so on. Once you know which classes you can register for, go to Goldmine again, but now click on Registration. Press Add Drop Classes, select the term, and submit. Go to the bottom and click on Class Search. Go to the bottom again and look at the class you want to register for. Just as an example, we will click on Accounting. If you're a freshman, do not attempt to register to a class that begins with two or more. The system won't let you. Before you register, take in consideration your time availability and the instructor you want to take the course with. Now press register and the course will be added to your schedule. If all classes appear to be with a C, they're all closed. You can always drop the class for our census if you want to register for another professor or any other time. You cannot drop a class if you're not already registered for your first class. Register one more course and then you will be able to drop that class. Moreover, if you would like to know your schedule by day and time, go to Registration. Click on Student Schedule by Day and Time. Enter any day from Fall 2020. It will then display your week schedule. Now, you're all set. Thank you for being part of the University of Texas of El Paso.